reinforcements have arrived. Timer started. Welcome back to Command and Conquer or Red Alert, the demo, and welcome to the second mission for the Allies, which is the fifth mission, or the fifth mission, second option in the original. This map is different, but it's different in a couple of uh, interesting ways. For example, there's an additional heavy tank here, there's a V2 launcher missing, there's a, a flame tower that's not here for some reason. So um, they did change this map here, but I'm not quite sure why. It's not as obviously changed as it used to be in the... That was the case for the first demo mission, but maybe this is just a revision just before the final revision for the for the release version. Who knows? In any case, let's see. There we go. Bunch of dogs here, but that doesn't matter now. Apparently, they didn't sniff out that spy. And boom. Also, this belongs to Turkey here, not to the Soviet Union. But I'm not quite sure whether that's the case in... Oop, didn't see that guy. I'm not sure whether that's the case in the original as well. It could be, it might be. No, I'm not saying that, so... Anyway, so those guys are cut off. Yeah, don't try to infiltrate the space here I, I, on this map specifically. It's that's not going to work out for you. All right. And let's evacuate Tanya. They sure have. Okay, whoop, you, you get out of there. You don't challenge the rifleman here. So now we also have less flame towers to deal with, which I guess is nice. So you please kill this flame tower here. Thank you. So just, just squish these guys here. I don't want to bother with infantry here. Okay, J just just kill them all and destroy the barracks. There we go. In this case, let's blow up these barrels here. Thank you very much. New construction options. Let's get a power plant straight away. Let's pop you down here. And let's get a refinery already. We can attack the, the factory here. But don't blow it up fully. No, 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 no. You do that. There we go. Because we want those heavy tanks, which you don't get if you... If you don't take over the Soviet factory, because if you build one from the construction yard, then you're just going to get the the allied construction options. The reason for that is that there isn't really a, a Soviet and allied construction yard. Instead, there's just one construction yard building and you you get whatever options you would get depending on what faction you're playing. So anyway, let's take over these as well. Could take over the ore silos, but I mean, come on, that's that's not worth it. Okay. Let's destroy this tower here. This, let's dispose of these dogs here. Then let's get the barracks back. And let's maybe get let's get let's get a flame tower here. And another ore truck. It feels like the Soviets are less aggressive here, but I, I could just be imagining that, to be honest. But maybe they are, so it's not as difficult for the player as it would otherwise be. I don't know, why were you, why did you drive so far north? I don't know, and it doesn't really matter. We could take over that. Okay, can you, can you please drive over there? Thank you. Could take that over. 
Well, most of you could just not bother actually joining in for the fight here, but whatever. There we go. We take that over because I have you left, so I may as well. And let's get a radar dome. There's also a couple of other differences, like the Soviets have more advanced power plants there, and and not just basic ones, but that's that's kind of a weird difference, so it doesn't really make much of a difference, if you know what I mean. Anyway. Let's place you here, and you just repair yourself. Let's get another power plant because you never know when you need another one. Yeah, I think the, the Soviets are not... They're either not set to to attack you early or they, they're not set to attack you at all here. And not that it really matters, mind you. Hey, you can build SAM sites. Oh, hey, we can build airfields. Yeah, the Soviets also have two airfields. They don't have those in the... in the original either. Hello. Sorry about that fence. Okay, let's just build more heavy tanks, because what, what else would we build? We could build another arms factory, then we get access to allied technology as well. Let's just do that, because... Stop that. Oh, squi oh you just squished three of those guys. Ouch, that must have hurt. Anyway, there's some activity. We can probably blow up their harvester soon. Yeah, so now we get access to the, the allied tank. Oh, we only get light tanks. We, didn't, we don't even get medium tanks. That's depressing. Do we have access to... Nope, only yak planes, but I mean, who, who needs yak planes? Nevertheless, we're going to go with heavy tanks. So let's waylay their harvester here. It's a lot of ore we have here. The ore is also slightly differently distributed. That's kind of weird that happens on maps like this. I don't think it's randomized, but not that it really matters, mind you. That's also the case for a couple of other maps where you have... Oh yeah, this this the the Soviet war factory. You have to come out. There we go. So this should get their attention. Goodbye. Oh yeah, it did get their attention already. Okay, hey, maybe you do need those SAM sites after all. So what did they even attack? Maybe base defenses? Oh, hello. Look at you. Well... Too bad you're good at yourself. Flame towers. Yeah, let's just destroy there. So what's what's going on here? How why, how are you still alive? How are you still alive? Never. M oh yeah, because I only attacked you with the with the rocket guys. So anyway, so let's maybe get rid of a couple of these rocket launchers here. And how about we get rid of this barracks here because they're spamming infantry fast now, and I don't like that. The dogs went straight after that pilot, that was to be expected. Of course, of course this happens, that's fine. What is it? Actually, it's not fine. You know what? Let's, let's put an end to this. Okay, enough with the construction yard here. There we go. No more barracks after this, and let's kill the heavy tank. But there's still, there's still artillery left, so let's see. Let me get rid of you. There we go. Oh, this is my favorite when they just fire when they are barely out of the factory. Or not even out of the factory, really. Hey, there's even a medium tank left here. Okay, there we go. You can destroy the, the miner here. There we go, we've got some nice reinforcements here, so let's just move over here and kill you all. Where did you come from? Never mind. I guess he I guess you were already in the base, I think. Anyway. 
Doesn't matter too much. Let's just build more of you. We'll, we'll take care of that harvester later. That's that's not going to be the issue. Yeah, the heavy tanks, they, I think they're better than the light ones, except for speed, which can be worth a lot, actually. But their rate of fire is significantly lower, so just because they have double barrels doesn't mean they're like twice as powerful as medium tanks in that regard. As you can see, there's airfields here and there's advanced power plants. Those are not in the release version for this map here. There we go. Let's get rid of all of you here. And, oh, fire sale. Yeah. I could have done that earlier, but never mind. Do they do a fire sale in the final version? I'm not even sure. Maybe they do, but maybe they don't. I don't think they do, at least not in the A variant for this map here. There we go. So very pretty, but oh so stubborn. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Not particularly different, but as I said, maybe this wasn't the specific demo version of the map. Maybe it was just a, an earlier revision that they then used for the demo and changed a little bit before release. Two buildings lost. What did I lose? Did they destroy the repair pad after all? Who knows? In any case, thanks for watching and I shall see you next time. Take care and goodbye.